Hello, I'm Sally, Sally Goddard, and I'm an artist. I work predominantly in oils, and I live in Arundel. I've lived here for about 25 years, I think, now. My name is Millie Swan. I'm a sculptor, and I have been sculpting for 45 years or so. And I started work mostly in carving stone and wood, and then have gone on to doing quite a lot of modelling and bronzes and welded sculpture. I've got uh, about t 10 or 12 of my oil paintings, my latest ones. I've got the inspiration for this one from an exhibition I did at the Ox Market in Chichester. So I've made different paintings of famous paintings and then I've added a little one of my own in there. A little bit of humour. The sunflowers, that was a recent one in lockdown. Beautiful sunflowers, the blue skies that we had in June. Um, so that's my lockdown picture. This one here came from an exhibition that I went to see earlier in the year, Bombug and the Old Masters, and my interpretation is Bombug style and with Poussin's Dance to the Music of Time as the central figures in it. Some of the landscapes I, I like doing as well. Um, I like to work on plein air when I can. We've got a nice, uh, the cricket up there. That was a beautiful day at Arundel Castle Cricket Club. The greenhouse is, is West Dean. I did a lot of studying at West Dean. I like to do very detailed work sometimes, as I've done in, in the exhibition picture and in that picture, but then I like to be much freer. So I quite like the juxtaposition of having some detail and then I'm, once I've done one of those paintings, I'll, I'll do another painting which is much freer, so it, it, uh, it, it's a variety. I started sculpting a long time ago, as I've said, but I started with stone carving originally and wood carving, and then I've moved more on to modelling things. And in the lockdown, um, one of the pieces I did, which sort of, for me, represents a bit of the lockdown, is the three birds on a rock, are sort of isolated together. And strangely enough, this piece, which is actually a bronze, I did a while ago, but it has the same sort of feel of the um, isolation, but togetherness of the lockdown. My other pieces that represented a bit are the birds in the trees, the gilded ones, and the um, terracotta ones. To me, they feel very individually isolated, but again, they're together with the tree in the branches. Paintings are influenced by Mirandi, who I went to his museum in Northern Italy. Um, I suppose they're quite introspective, but... And then I've moved on and done quite a lot of gilding, so I used just to do sculpture for a long, long time, but um, I've recently got into painting the last, I don't know, three years or something. In fact, I sometimes sort of dream of standing in front of a huge canvas, you know, 24 foot by eight or something. Um, but I don't think it'll ever happen. <laughs> yeah.